Yes, church, 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 church. Yeah, what's up guys, it's your boy Cameradrix here. I'm bringing you a gameplay from my friend Can I Be Pro, uh, his nickname is Meadows. He um, told me it was pretty decent. So I thought I'd take a look at it. He's got a UMP with a silencer. Um, and I'm pretty sure he beasts up in this game. Yes, he does. He uses a variety of weapons, but anyway, he's, he's a beast. He does things like drop shot and that, which I didn't do. So I thought I'd bring you a bit of variety. Anyway, one thing I want to talk about in this um, this gameplay was like how to improve and the best ways to sort of get better at the game in, and, and improve your chances of getting an MOB, MOAB, and um, not dying as much. I think things like kill streaks and the setup of your gun is really important. What I usually have on my guns is a silencer because I think trying to um, stay like, discreet from where. Um, to try and make sure that your enemies can't find you, that's always key. I have a silencer on almost every one of my guns. And one thing, I've one gun I've started to use is the ACR. I haven't used it before. I usually just use the UMP Striker uh, M4, M4A one with a red dot on silencer. And I've started using it and it's a beast of a gun. It's not, um, not like a gay little gun like the Time 95. I hate that gun. I've started using it and I really, really like it. Anyway, what I've been doing the past few days, I've been really busy, but what I have been doing on YouTube is looking at people's um, strategy videos or maps and the best like class setup to, to improve yourself. Um, one class setup that I've started to use is Specialist because I find I just run around. Um, I use I usually Scavenger Pro because I usually run out of ammo, Assassin, and it might be Recon, I'm not sure if I use Recon or not. Um, and I said, yeah, you use silencer. And one thing I've started to use as well, which I've rarely used, is the portable radar. It just gives you so much more of an advantage. And unless you have the Care Streak package on, which is UAV, then it gives you much more, like a better chance of finding where the enemies are. And I think, try and stay to the edges of maps. Like you can see this guy here, he's staying in uh, one area. Well, not he's not staying in one area, but he's being cautious of where he goes. He can see that there's enemies close. And he doesn't just run in, he runs in because he knows he can kill the enemies. So if you just use things tactically, if you watch here, he puts, his, he puts his UAV down and he doesn't just run in, he waits for the kill to come to him. So don't run in like a headless chicken, use your brain when you're playing. A lot of people I find, they just run in, like you'd say run into a grenade or blah blah blah. Like play with your brain and don't just play in as in just running in and just messing around. One thing I talked about in the last video was the Arsenal uh, Man U game. Bit of a disappointment. Arsenal lost that game 2-1. Um, I wouldn't say Man U deserved it because they didn't. We had a guy called um, Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain who's um, 18 I think. He's absolutely quality. He played amazing and then for some reason in around the 73rd minute I think it was. Wenger took him off and brought on our Shavin which is this guy from a um, club called St. Petersburg, we bought him um, a year ago, two years ago I think and oh my days, our Shavin is absolutely atrocious, like abysmal terrible player uh, anyway, back to the gameplay I don't really know what Meds is doing here yeah Meds is the nickname of the guy I was, who's um, playing here, he's t I told you before he's 10th proceed in every Call of Duty which I don't understand how people can do because I get bored of Call of Duty very very easily yeah I, d I don't know why I get bored of the Call of Duty I've I think it's mainly because a lot of things in Call of Duty I think they need to fix the uh, the servers are abysmal I seem to get lagged out of so many games the spawning is often pretty bad so a lot of people seem to camp on Team Deathmatch a lot of people just seem to sit in a corner and ruin your kill streaks, which is takes the piss. Takes the fucking piss. What I'm going to um start doing um from now is every Saturday I'm gonna try and upload Wow, good spray there meds. Upload and every sub Saturday, sorry, I'm gonna put a video up and people can comment on the video and then the first comment I get or I may choose a comment at random, they'll go in my sub box just to try and help people, you know, promote their videos as well and make sure that other people have equal opportunity to get their videos out there if you want to 
um, show me your channel or describe your videos um, feel free to comment on my channel um, let me know what your videos are about I don't tend to like trick shot videos or videos that show insane dribble kills because I don't usually tend I don't seem to tend to do trick shots or anything like that or quick scopes it's never been maybe I'm, I don't know maybe I'm not good enough blah 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 I've just never tended to do that I just like straight gameplay you, you know using your brain Outsmart, I love outsmarting people, it's brilliant. You know, you see someone come in, dark run around the corner, or you just... Because some kids just don't understand, I don't understand why they don't use tactics. Because I think a lot of Call of Duty is, if you just use your mind and you play to your game, you play to you like you play to what you're good at. So if you get a portable radar up, if you've got UAV as well, you're always going to know where the enemy is, unless they have things like Assassin on. So if you just use your brain, then the chances are that you'll get a, a really high kill streak. You won't die much. And you just have to understand that if you play like a noob and you run in, the chances are you're going to die. If you think about how you're going to play, if you think about your class setup, if you think about, oh, if I use a silencer, they're not going to kill me. They're not going to hear me, sorry. Then there you go. Bish, bash, bosh. You know, how's your mother? So anyway, pretty decent uh, final game kill. As I said, I wouldn't... Uh, game winning kill I wouldn't usually get a no scope. Anyway, I really hope you enjoyed lads. Check out my videos to come. Or lads or ladies anyway. <laughs> anyway, peace.